Okay, I guess I gotta make this uh, video a little shorter than the last one I tried to post. Uh, I'd just like to, to start off by introducing myself. I'm Corey. I'm 47 year old, um, lifelong Texan. Uh, I've been married for 22 years. Uh, my wife is, uh, is uh, Puerto Rican descent. She is American. Um, we've been married for 22 years, known each other since 99. We have two awesome 15 year olds. Uh, not 15 year olds, this is stupid. We have two awesome teenage daughters. One who happens to be 15. Anyway, um, like I said, we've been married for 24, 22 years. Um, we met in the military. We, we uh, were both in the Navy. We met in, uh, in, in, in the Navy. Um, anyway, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm here today because well, I can't technically stand up right now, but I'm standing up. Uh, I'm, I'm offering, I'm offering to stand beside you and hope you'll agree to stand beside me in, in doing what needs to be done. Um, this country is, is, is run by corporate America through lobby lobbyists uh, of our, you know, elected representatives they're representing those those corporations and not the people that elected them um i mean i don't see how you can't see that corporate america is controlling literally everything i, I, I mean a year ago i could go get a week's worth of groceries you know not every single thing i needed but you know all the side items, uh, you know, a couple of things, some, some hamburger meat, uh, cereal, milk, uh, all the essentials, you know what I mean? For a family of four, for, you know, on average around a hundred bucks. I'm, I'm pretty thrifty. Anyway, so, you know, let's say a year ago, maybe, you know, a year and a half, a hundred dollars average. I, I could do what I just described. Now, Today, December 15th, 2023, that same amount of groceries, mm, I mean, I've had to cut back on things that I buy, even cutting back on things that I would normally, if you want to air quote, splurge, um, you know, Pop-Tart, Chef Boyardee, um, you know, Oreo, not Oreos, you know, store brand Oreo knockoffs. Even though I cut out some, you know, some, you know, some of those things as, as much as I, you know, can, but you know, you know, that same bill it, it is around 150 bucks on average, and that's even with, you know, cutting back on certain things. Like I said, you know what that is? I have a city job, uh, you know. I'm not working a minimum wage job. Uh, that right there is, is called donating plasma. I have to donate plasma in order to supplement the income that, that, that won't cover corporate greed. I have to donate plasma. In the meantime, those one to two percent that are that are that are actually uh, representing or, or, or controlling this country, they've, they've never had to do that. Never. Never. Never had to set the, you know, oh, well, I can't buy a jet this year because, uh, you know, I had to put my kid through college or whatever it might be, which I paid up front, talking as a one to two percent or so that's not acceptable, and and I'm I'm not smart enough to know what the plan needs to be, but I am smart enough to know that at minimum my obligation to my children requires me to to uh, you know to stand up with you. That, that's what, what what our nation is founded on the people of the people, for the people, by the people. That, 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 at its crux, the, this nation is founded on that principle. 
So, uh, on those principles. So, uh, like I said, I want to stand up. Will you stand up with me? I'll stand up with you. I don't care what your political views are. I don't. I don't care what your thoughts on Bud Light are. I don't. I don't care what your, uh, you know, your thoughts on religion are. It, that those those things don't matter because we are we are us. I'm you. And, and and until okay, so I looked this up just real quick to end the video here, so I don't make it too long. I did some research yesterday. I mean, it's it's not really research. It just took me a few seconds. So the 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 population of the United States as of yesterday was three hundred. Um, what is it? Anyway, basically, uh, ninety-eight percent of the population. I didn't calculate just one percent because I know you know collaterally there's more than one percent that are actually in charge. So 2% of the uh, of the current U.S. population is roughly 329 million people. On the other side of that, you have the, you know, 2% that of the, out of the same calculation, which is 6.7 million people. I mean, the numbers are in our favor. Uh, I don't advocate violence, and I don't think violence is needed. Although I said, I, you know, I'm not intelligent. I don't think I'm intelligent enough to come up with the plan. But I don't think it, it's necessary. What they understand is money. Although I don't agree with the, the whole Bud Light outrage. It showed what, you know, how we can make a, a change. How we can affect their pocketbooks. And that was just a small percentage of the population, you know, uh, you know, hitting them in that way. If we all stood up and, and, and did the same for everything then what choice would they have? We can't do it for one day. We've got to be willing to do it for as long as it takes until things change. And I'm willing to do that. I, won't, I, I don't go to Starbucks anyway. But yes, I do I do shop at Walmart. I do shop at, at uh, you know, for other major things. And, and I'll stop. I can get my groceries elsewhere. I can go to a local grocery store. I'll go to the local taqueria. Um, you know, sometimes their prices are cheaper anyway, especially on, you know, good, you know, meats and things like that. So let's do it. Let me know when and where, and I'll be there standing right beside you. Um, I love all of you. Thank you for, um, I don't know. Anyway, um, I'll make more videos and expand on things more. That's just what I had to say in this one. I just wanted to introduce myself and let everyone know that, that I'm willing to stand up and stand beside you and demand change. Um, I will talk to you guys soon.